10,000 and today we're out at Potts Preserve by the water. Um, Shea Bear made a mistake. We were, he was kept telling me it was for next weekend, the 27th, and he looked it up uh, late last night and found out it was for Friday, this Friday. So we came out last night and he found a spot and he put his tent up so um, he came home with me and then um, he's been out here all day today. I took my mother to Walmart and we did a few things. So I just got back and I bought me and, and Bruno a new, new tent. So there we go. And Shea Bear is going to help me put it up. So that's cool. I wanted to get a pop-up tent, but um, they didn't have any. So we'll check this out and see how well it works. And you never know. I like the idea over here. It's showing where you can put this halfway, and then you can have halfway. So you're getting airflow in the tent in the evening if it's not going to rain. But you still have the back here, you know, that's covered. So, or you can do it this way. So, and then you can take the whole thing off too, right there. So, we'll check it out. We'll be right back. Okay, guys, so Shea Bear's got a knife here, which is dangerous for me. And, um, I'm going to hand him my camera, I guess, and I can open this up. Okay? All right. Careful. Yeah. You don't want to cut the tip. No. Oh, I need to cut it here. Or not. Okie dokie. So we got some directions here, maybe. Stop. Stop. Do it's not return this it. item to the to the retailer. Bullshit. Yeah. I didn't buy it from the manufacturer. I bought it from you know. Yeah. That's I, the way I, I look at it. Yeah. That's not right. Yeah, that's what you can tell them. Say, hey, I didn't I didn't buy it from Ozark Trail. I bought it from Walmart. That's right. That's who you buy it from. So. And they bought it from them. nothing else in there okay so we're gonna open this sucker up oh, I hear them there's the steaks I like the color yeah mm -hmm. Those are gotta be the the poles. The poles in there. That's your rain hat, you call it. My rain hat. And this is the tent. <laughs> yeah. All right. So where you want it? I don't know. Right here. Probably, yeah. What's that? I don't know. You know where the door is? My guess is it's right there. Well, you want it angled, right? Oh, okay. To that. Like that. Now, you got to pull this this way. Is that the door or is that the door? That's the door, ain't it? Or is it? Let me get you set up on a pod. All right. Look, pretty. 
I think so. This might be for the fly. No, that's for the fly. Maybe that's supposed to be in there. Oh, that's why I asked are they the same size? They don't look at me. It's a for you know? Yeah, right? Be the frat because it has the emblem there. Recording. So I'll bet this one goes through here mm -hmm. into that grommet right there. Okay. Two doors on that fucker? Yeah. Yeah, so I want two doors on mine. Alright. Now. You want to take it down now? Yeah. yeah. They say to do it first, but in case you got to move it, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like you're right up against that root there, you might want to bring the front this way see that root right there yeah I don't know why that one's yellow and all the other ones are black uh -uh. boy these are some hefty steaks they're like at least twice the size of the ones for a big tent
no joke. Look at that thing. So, yeah, this is a zipper. That's a zipper? Yeah. So, I have to do what it is. Right? Yeah, it's a Oh, this is a zipper too, right? Oh, this is a no, this is a zipper right here too, so they must have one front and one for the back. Wait, hey, I'm betting yellow to yellow. Yellow to yellow. Follow what I'm saying? Yeah, yellow to yellow and the black goes to the black. Asking. Okay. So it bears this way, I'm going to 
Well, now we know why that one's yellow. Yeah. Yeah. You can't say, why is this yellow? Why is it yellow? Now we know. You got left. Two. Wait, wait. How are you going to stick it down? I don't know. See, you got one for here and one for back there. Oh, do you? Yeah. Oh. Well, that's coming in now. And then you roll this up like this. Right. Both open for now? Yeah, we could. Air it out. Oh, I see a little bit. I'll do it. The other one's for the... Okay. Cute, huh? Not bad. Alright. Now you said there was a way you could have it halfway? Yeah. So you could just roll that over halfway and then peg it down and then if and it this, rains you could bring it back. This rolls up because that's what these are for. Uh huh. It's these. Uh huh. You know what I mean? And then you peg this out and it'll be halfway. Mm -hmm. Was well, that the way you want it? Well no, because I, I hear that thunder and lightning. <laughs> so? It's cool. I, you know. If you had it halfway, but you know, let's do it.
paint scheme just look like a purple and white. Mm -hmm. And uh, this thing was badass. It was the best sound boat I've seen out here all fucking day. Really? <laughs> yeah. So, I don't know if you leave these like this or not. But. somewhere, you know, handy. Mm -hmm. So if it rains. That's cute. I like it. I think. You like it? I think so. Very good. Yeah. That's easy to set up. Yeah. So there's our, my tent. See, it didn't tell you yellow to yellow. No. No. Hmm. It just says it's laid out, peg mm -hmm. it down. Put your poles in the next pattern and hook them up. Huh. Pretty much is all it says. It doesn't say yellow to yellow on that rain fly. Alright, so I'm going to get my stuff that's in the back of the car. <laughs> ah! In fact, they don't even tell you anything about the rain fly. <laughs> we did this on the fly. We had to figure this out ourselves, the fly part. Wow. By the picture, basically. Alright guys, no, I'm no, going to get my see. stuff and put it inside and then I'll show you the whole thing. I'll be back. Okay, guys, that's my tent. And Bruno will be together in here. And there you go. So it's not too bad. I'll straighten up my stuff when I get in there. It's hard for me to bend over, so once I get in there, I'll straighten it all up. But there is, like he said, there is um, a couple of things that are missing on this tent. And that is there's no pockets on the inside for anything. And another thing is there's no extension cord hole anywhere on here. Yeah, usually they have a little <laughs> port so you can run an extension cord in. Yeah, so those are two, two things that are missing on this. Um, they do say it's for hiking, but it's pretty heavy for hiking. It's for a two-person. Maybe that's what they're figuring. Somebody's going to carry this and a couple items. Somebody will carry right. something else and a couple items. Right, right. So... I like the color. I like how you can put the sides up on each side if you want, or you can leave one and the other one down. You know, I do like that. I think that's a nice feature. And then you put these stakes in, so even if it's raining and I put this side down, I have a hole, you know, to get in and out, and I can leave that like that, so... Would you tell me if there's a bear on this side, you can get out the other side? Yeah, right? there is two doors on this, yes. <laughs> So I told him if the bear was over here, I could go over there and run to that car right there. So, I feel safe. Probably not, but it was my brain idea. So, cool. All right, so Shea Bear, he's got his setup over here. I did not show you. He, he decided to put it up in the air so he'd get more cooling. And I think it helped, don't you? Yeah, because he's not be on the ground. I th I don't think he get as much um, air through there. So 
and he has to keep himself. I can feel it when it was raining. Yeah. I can feel the air. Yeah. Stay dry in there, but mm -hmm. I could feel some air moving. Yeah. Yeah, it poured when I was at Walmart. I could hear it inside, and we we're just getting ready to leave. And then it stopped, and the sun came out. So by the time I even got to to go to the parking lot, it was all gone. Well, I was hemmed up in that thing for half an hour. Wow. Yeah. And I was thinking, I hope he's not getting rained on. Oh, I got rained on. Aw. Well. So, anyways... I have to go back to the house. I got to get a few things for us. He did catch a couple of fish. We'll show you when I get back, I guess. Um, I got to get the fillet knives that he, we have. And, um, yeah, so I got to get my frying pan because I guess he's going to make, make fish tonight. Yay! Finally, we're getting some fish. Mm -hmm. I did bring him a dinner. You know, something simple. He wanted, he wanted something simple. Just in case he caught fish, we'll eat the fish. I said, okay, fine. So, he does have something else. If he wants a snack on it later, he can do that too. So, and that's it. Bruno's stuck in the car. Still, he's hot. So, I leave him be for right now. And then I might bring, when I come back, I'll put him inside here. He'll like that. I'll take his cooling pad and we'll put it in there too. Maybe he'll lay on the cooling pad in there. So that's a nice little setup. Yeah. So at least I could have done was give you one of those hook nets up there. You know? Like we have in the other one. There's a little thing you can hang up <coughs> in there. Yeah, for a little light or something? Yeah, there is a little thing for that. I'll have to get me a little light. I don't have one. No. Broke the one. I broke Ben's, yeah, the one that Ben. I was upset about it too. We'll to and there was no way we could fix it, so we'll have I've to get. It. Do you still to, have it? I'm to try to fix it. Okay. So, anyways, yeah, there are some hooks inside. I don't know what you would use those for. I don't know. Maybe, maybe that helps. I don't know. Maybe that's for the. I don't know what those little blue hook things would be for. Those handles? Yeah. Yeah, you see them? On each side of the doors? Yeah, it unzips. Yeah. I'm thinking that unzips. Oh. So your window can open. Oh, well that would be nice. Yeah, because it's nice the zipper goes all the way around instead of, of like our um, other one, the, the new one we bought. It only goes from down up. That's it. There's no, in, there's nothing. So you can't do any more than that. So I like, I like how you can move the zipper around, you know, if you want to. Anyways, I'm going to run back to the house before it gets too bad. And, uh, yeah, he needs a few things and, um, I will get back here. Okay, babe? Yep. Two large mouth bass coming right up. Yay! Just legal size, too. Wow, that's cool. I'll show it to him when I get back. All right. All right. We'll be back. Okay, guys, so I finally made it back. And here's the Bruno. He's sitting in the tent. And it's cooling off a little bit. Shea Bear just got another bite. And what did he catch? A friggin' turtle. So, here's this fish on the ground over here. Well, I had to throw him down. My pole was taking off. So, we're going to eat those. He's going to clean them up, and we're going to eat those for dinner. And he's got a turtle over here. There he goes. Yeah. There he goes in the water. The turtles. You're the turtle man. Yeah, You're the turtle, turtle man. It. Oh no, I just bought that too. Wow. Yeah. Those are those things I bought on Timu for the poles. And I think they work alright, but the turtle bent it a little bit so he had to straighten it up. But I think it'll be alright. Okay. So. <laughs> pretty out here. And, uh, it is pretty. So. I'm finally going to be able to relax. So. Yeah. I'm going to sit down and I'm going to relax for a few minutes before I do anything else. 
I'll be back. Hey everyone, so yesterday, um, as you knew, we were out here and we were fishing and he made the fish and it was really, really good. Um, yeah, it was really good fish that he made. But he was in so much agony with his dang back again. So he brought a battery out and so he could l turn the light on and stuff like that. So um, he thinks it was caused by picking up that battery and a combination of other things. So we ended up having to go home again. So we're back out here. It is supposed to be a horrible day. It's supposed to rain all day. I hear it. We hear thunder now. So we come out here. We have most of the stuff in the car. I just left it in the car. I'm not going to unpack in the middle of the night. So... Um, I'm just going to get our tents up before it rains and we're going to try to do a little bit of fishing and um, as long as it doesn't rain. So we'll see how that well that works. I didn't even get to try out my tent last night. So, oh well. It is what it is. You know, when you're in pain, all you want to do is go home to your bed. So, and we're not far. It's not like we're two or three hours away or anything. So, that's what happened last night. So stay tuned if uh, anything happens, we'll turn you back on. How exciting. He caught something so big. This is what he caught. Another turtle. I hate these things. He loves turtles. He's not very big. He's probably He's... about seven pounds. Yeah? He wanted that food, didn't he? <laughs> okay guys it's raining so we're sitting here to see if it'll blow over because we've had spurts and then it stopped so we've been fishing trying to huh babe well we fished in the rain a little bit ago <coughs> but it was just a slight rain yeah that cloud that rolled in we thought we'd better head to the truck for a few just in case yeah yeah so we're gonna sit here and see, cause we have the site until tomorrow. Yep. So we can stay here as long as we want today. Yeah. So if it stops. Looks like it's lightening up. So we thought we'd just come and yeah. wait it out, see what happens. If not, we'll go home. But if it clears up, we'll do some more fishing. Yeah. They're biting. Yeah, they are. They're biting. Smaller ones, but if smaller ones are eating, bigger ones are too. Yeah. Well, we know the turtles are. I love you. <laughs> Anyways, stay tuned. We'll tell you what's going on after a bit. Okay, guys. So, we decided to go home. It's pouring out and, you know, even if we stayed, we're just going to get soaked. <clears throat> and, um... Where we where we were fishing at, it's just gonna be a mud hole. So I gotta take this car through, and he's getting the gate. There we go. So, anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed some of what we did. Um, it's too bad that we had to go home, but you know, I'd rather go home than be safe for shaver. So, um, yeah. We have reservations here for next weekend too, so we might, we were talking that we might just use it as a day thing and then just go home at night since he's having a hard time. So that way we can maybe bring a lunch or a dinner and we can do maybe something like that and then we'll um, fish and hopefully we can catch some more fish. Okay, so Mike and Sister Steph now. Bye y'all.